Hello, you're watching the Star News Update. I'm Joanne Dimbuang. The Election Commission has fixed March 29th as nomination day for the Batang Ai by-election in Sarawak, while polling day is on April 7th. The nomination and polling dates are the same as the by-elections for the Bukit Gantang Parliamentary seat in Perak and the Bukit Selambau state seat in Kedah. Chairman Tan Sri Abdul Aziz Muhammad Yusuf says the Commission decided to hold the three by-elections at the same time so as not to prolong the campaign period. Tarikh penamaan calon 29 March Tarikh pengundian jika sekiranya ada pertandingan 7 April 2009 Selasa Jadi maknanya tiga pilihan raya satu di Batang uh, Air yang kedua di Bukit uh, Gantang dan yang ketiga di Bukit Selampau Tiga-tiganya serentak He said this at a press conference in Kuching, Sarawak, Wednesday The Batang Aif seat fell vacant following the death of its four-term assemblyman Datuk Dublin Unting Inkot on February 24th the Human Resources Ministry hopes to turn to locals 15,000 jobs a month now held by foreign workers. Some 15 sectors will be identified, with the services industry being one of them. Minister Dato Dr. S. Subramaniam says the ministry would identify jobs suitable for locals to take over from foreign workers. Dr. Subramaniam says the ministry is also studying the implications of a pension scheme proposal for private sector workers. Home Minister Dr. Sri Syed Hamid Alba has admitted that the police made mistakes in handling the Perak State Assembly fiasco on Tuesday. He adds that the Bar Council should look at the situation from the point of law. When one trespasses, he says, it is the duty of the police to stop him. Syed Hamid was referring to Tuesday morning's incident when police prevented Pakatan Rakyat Assemblymen, including former Perak Menteri Besar Dr. Sri Muhammad Nizar Jamaluddin, from entering the State Secretariat building in Ipoh to hold an emergency seating of the State Assembly. For more updates, log on to thestaronline.tv. I'm Joanne Tim Wong. Thanks for watching.